everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're trying to stop a service in Task Manager, or perhaps you're on some other sort of process manager, and it says that it was unable to stop the service, the operation could not be completed, the request to control is not valid for this service. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial, guys, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we are going to go ahead and start by opening up the task manager. So just right click on the taskbar and select task manager. Select the details tab. Now there's going to be a PID number here. So just take note of whatever the number is. So let's just say for this tutorial, I'm going to turn off the office process. So 2244. I'm just going to take note of that. So just make sure you have that somewhere nearby and you're going to go ahead and minimize or close out the task manager and now you're going to go open up the start menu type in PowerShell best resort should go back to Windows PowerShell go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator if you receive a user account control prompt go ahead and select yes and now you're going to go type in KILL space minus sign ID and then a space and now you're going to type in whatever that code was so in my case it was 2244 but in your case it may be different well it more than likely will be different but just take note of it and then you're going to hit enter on your keyboard it's going to say you sure you want to perform the stop process operation on the following items I'm going to go tap the Y key on my keyboard hit enter to confirm and that should be it if I open up task manager you can see that PID number has been terminated. You can see this new one here, it's a different number, but the one that we were addressing earlier has been turned off, or at least disabled for this point in time. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. Do hope that I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.